Hello everyone! Welcome to this short video about a medium-sized toad who is critically endangered. We are talking here about the bleeding toad or Leptophryne credentata. Bleeding toads are medium-sized toads that have dark purple bodies with blood red to yellow marbling present on the back and legs. This fire toad is a species of true toad, family Bufonidae, and it's endemic to Java in Indonesia. And what is one of the causes of their extinction? Chytridia mycosis. It's caused by the chytrid fungus. It's little to amphibians, primary frogs, and some salamanders. Chytrid fungus run from one infected amphibian to a new host through either direct contact or infected water sources. Once it finds a new host, chytrid fungus infects amphibian's skin. It changes the keratin layer in the outer skin, causing infected patches of skin to become rough, thick and more water resistant. This is bad news for amphibians since they change air, absorb water and absorb some vital salt through their skin. And they can die for a number of reasons like not being able to absorb enough water, suffocating or heart attack due to loss of salt. The effects of global climate change may also contribute to the decline of the species. You can read and learn about the species Bleeding Toad on the website The International Union for Conservation of Nature, Red List of Threatened Species. It was founded in 1964. This website is a critical indicator of the health of the world's biodiversity. You can see there are some animals, how is their population trend, how many mature individuals are in the world, their habitat, ecology and their threats. You can also take a look at another species and how they are doing. Conservation Actions this species occurs in Mount Grede, Pangranamo National Park and Mount Haliman Salak National Park. It's officially protected by the government of Indonesia. As noted by Kusrine, conservation is needed and breeding program might need to be established. Protection of its main habitat in the third waterfall of Siberia is also recommended by closing the area to recreational tourism. Our team is trying to find possible solutions for conservation of these species, so please follow us and support our goal to help change the fate of these species. Thank you for watching.